All right, so what should we bring? Oh my god, any Maligar team. Ah, uh, well, maybe a fire type to deal with those bug types. Should he lead? I don't know. Well, we haven't seen Gabite yet. Yeah. We'll take Grottle oh just for shits and giggles. What? The nerves in the same song I keep twitching. Or the muscle spasms for some reason. I have an airbow on my chest. Just hold your breath. Well, you have a slight disadvantage. Hmm? Type wise. Fortunately, both of your ground have attacks do nothing. And now, the battle begins. A rigid shot. I'm starving. I can't walk, I guess. Oh, right in the dick. I need to get my Staravia figure fixed. Because my brother ripped the legs off of it, the tail off my Shanks, and the tail off my Monferno. So I need my the legs fixed to do that. Hey. Have I mentioned my nostalgia Pokemon is technically Starly? Because that is the, that is the first Pokemon I ever caught. That is that is not a wiki card. That's Satan. He is not a god. Is that he has a swirly eyes like Wiki? <laughs> 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 That's how you eat a pussy. <laughs> I can't confirm nor deny. Actually, I, I can't either. We will never know. Oh yeah, I can use my ground type attacks. Didn't work. It's attack missed. Obviously, it didn't work. Well, He's some bit from the area, Laysome. He's too fat. Screech does not work. The red corner still can't pull up a move. I am glad they got the guy from the. Oh my god, why is the screen yellow again? I don't know. This has been going on for a while. I think it's from our setup. Really? This is. This has been Try going turning on the light. No, it's just the camera. Oh, uh, did I? Uh, speaking of Lucky Chong, I have to check the logo. It tried to use Shockwave on Gabite. Well, it doesn't look like a ground. God damn it, Diggy Man Fire. I like it more in Black and White, where it's just the sound of like sand being rustled. Oh. Hmm? I didn't know sand team is a sort of like quicksand. Or like stereotypical quicksand. Huh. Because in quicksand you're more likely to get oh God. stuck. It's really intense. liquidy and if you stand- You don't sink. You just stay there. And it's down. It's getting buried in a sand tube. You just can't move. Because it's really watery. Like if you pat it with your hand, it will be going jelly. Sort of. We had a Monferno the entire time. You forgot about that. You could just mock punch that. That's a, that tone. shows a really ugly shade of blonde for the trainers in Re Val Revolution. And when we are able to customize our character, we can uh, make them look much better. Well, hold on! Huh? How come it can do that in Battle Revolution in the anime, but in the, the 3D, 3DS games, but Beautifly can't close its eyes? Really? Yeah. Huh. Well, it can close its eyes in the anime. Yeah, but it can't do it in the games. Sort of like uh, most bugs, it's like compound eyes. Or like, but apparently not for Beautifly. Youthful couple, there's one of you. We might need Grottle. 
Alexio. Star Did yeah. she break up and forget to change her resume from a youthful couple? That'd be funny. To single lady? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, oh, oh, she is oh, all oh, one oh. of all the single ladies. I'm enjoying my youth. She says after Her name is Ariel. You didn't realize? Oh, it is. That makes perfect sense. She was 16. Fell for a prince with no personality. I can make a first degree murder against a sea witch. And then, despite having no vagina, conceived a child. Maybe she got one when trying to give her legs. I don't know. What's awesome? Bah! She's the only Disney princess to reproduce. Really? She's the only one to have a kid. That's really interesting to know, actually. But also, Melody does not look. She doesn't look like a baby. She looks like a six year old. Maybe a four year old. Meanwhile, Baby Rapunzel looks like a doll, which was the whole point. There's no baby looks like that. No newborn, especially. They look like moldy onions. Or tomatoes, depending. What's this captivate? Oh, special attack, okay. It's Good thing true. I have all physical. And that's how you had the little mermaid. In the one time I've seen it. And I also think it. Whoa, what the fuck was that? What? Where are my damn flowers? Oh, no, you're screwed. They're squares! But they made. I can't explain it very well unless you get a good shot of Wormadam again. They see those flowers? They were made parts of the square transparent. But when a huh. stat raises or lowers, you can see the squares. Huh. Come on. You're in love with that thing? Give it a hickey. It's a bag worm. There's no way you can get He's just eating the grass off of her. Nom, nom, nom. I mean, she can just put it back. That's an underrated Pokemon I've liked, Wormadam. Burmy's an interesting What about one, this though. one? Yeah. You always loved Corsola. Burmy's just interesting how it changes depending on where it is. It, what? it was expecting to move a second. Wow, one hit. And then, depending on which environment it's in when it evolves, it turns into a Wormadam. For some reason, Mothin looks better. It's like, why? I guess most- there are some moths that- or butterflies, I don't know which one. Where the female literally never leaves the, chrys the cocoon stage, the chrysalis stage. The male turns into a butterfly, finds a chrysalis, sticks his two moth antenna looking dick into it, impregnates it, and she dies laying eggs, and he just dies a few days later. Hmm. Starting butterfly mating is, he sticks out his abdomen with little moth things, antenna looking dick, taps the female on the back of the abdomen, and you're pregnant. That's it. It's like cuttlefish, where he just swims up, taps, very gently. He goes, you're pregnant, and then flies off. An octopi stick your dick in your ear. They stick their dick in the girl's ear. I don't. Though it also might have been a dude. Stick your dick. Show your love for your. Listen here, Gabe. Failure on the part of you. Show your love to your boyfriends by sticking your dick in his ear. <laughs> Consensual octopus love. Anyway. Oh, the semi-final. Oh, let's go to Todd in a sec. Oh, Wait, God. Wait, no, we're at nine minutes. It's, oh, yeah, it's Todd Howard. Is that the other half? He has a Mothim and a, wor a trash cloak Wormadam, despite not looking very trashy. I don't know. Because uh, if she's part of the youthful couple and he's the other half, despite being called a sci-fi nerd rather than a young couple, it's like, she got herself a sugar daddy. Do I want to do a selfie? <laughs> I like this guy. <laughs> Speaking of, Mothim. I'm still itchy. I have, I have weird red spots on me that will fade away in like four weeks. 
They itch sometimes. Though not by much. I should have punched it. It is a bug flying type. What? I just kind of like maybe can't sound the Motham's wings would probably make. I always wondered why Motham was always a dude. Because he looks really cute. Well, is there a problem with it being a dude? It's me, of course, sir. Oh. No, oh, this guy's one of my yes, favorite Pokemon. Be just a dude. Not that one in particular, it's all of them. Hmm. It's like Braviari, but boy was I dismayed. Meanwhile, the woman is a ruthless vulture, which isn't actually its counterpart. It just happened, or at least wasn't supposed to. Be. Wasn't supposed to be. Considering they're also created by two Braviari and Ruffwit, and then are well, created well, by completely different people from Mandibuzz and Mullaby, who were created by James Turner. Well, that's out. Goodbye, you. What the hell was it? Yeah, his body did not agree with him there. All right. Ah, uh, it's a steel type. Bug steel. So you know what we're doing. Yeah. And it missed. The move can't hit the opponent. Woo! Almost lay you on fire this tail. <laughs> that, would, that would be a funny way to end the battle. Oh, and Nate is on fire now. That's why you don't play with fire types, kids. Don't start talking like Mad Pat. Sorry. I didn't know. Sorry. He may. No, I found. I didn't know either. It was a review of why someone doesn't like him, and I'm just like, I don't like him, Mad Pat either. Let me watch this video, and then I watch an hour-long video about Polybius and whether or not it's real or not. I can't. Nine in the almost nine in the morning, laying in bed, the tablet, headphones, just like. Yep. This so is if we can do an do. extra long video and get the finale done, we're not at 15 minutes yet. All right. Blah, 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 blah. It's Taylor. What? I remember Taylor. Who do we want to bring? I see her star Pokemon. Gabba is a good option. Her star is Pachirisu. Or, well, I guess, because I, she looks a lot like one. I mean, battle is now at its oh god, she's a furry. A stronger opponent is going to appear. From the blue corner, Monferno, and from the red corner, Curlia. Such energy. And I'm an idiot and forgot that Curlia was there. How did I forget Curlia? After being sent out and also loving the hell out of Curlia. <laughs> what are you doing with your arms? I'm trying to give away the bad vibes. Keep those bitches out of my way. Yeah. No, stay away! Stay away! Ah! My huge of it's oh my god, and it does a bat, and it's sort of does a traditional bat, uh, bat arena bow. There it is! Special! Look at the big one in the background! Oh god, it's coming for me! And in competitive play, Patrices can beat Garchomps. Well, I yes they can. I remember. So that. I guess Gabite's screwed. Well, no, it's a it has to be a double. But, battle. It, it, it has to be a double battle. Right. And also, Patrice, I don't I don't remember if it won the fight, but at least contributed greatly to it. Well, it made like the entire people cheer for it. Yeah. But it took the me first. It, it lived. It used to follow me. Which allows the opponent to only hit it, which allowed its teammate to land the attack. Oh. If I remember, I think I, because I saw the clip of it. I think I win. What? Yeah, Pachirisu is out. No surprise. 
My second favorite Pikachu's distant relative. First being Emolga. Patrice is currently tied with Toby tomorrow, Dendene in itself. And still, Monferno is the only one of our Pokemon to faint. Too much Taco Bell! Ow. Shit! <laughs> Sounds like a cool kid. I will send out Gabite against the water type. How funny is that that I'm ending this with my favorite one of all the Pokemon we have? I love this little mouth movement. Oof. Yay! Look at the eyes! Has like the... God, the kawaii eyes. Goodbye, Beedle. But it was fun. Yeah. Alright, now I have an... Yay! We'll never see that Beedle again. No! Don't worry, I think there's more Beedles. Good. I ate coupons. We got 350! Yeah, Pikachu badge. Yeah! And hey, in the Pikachu badge. The Coliseum just opened, but also there's a, the Gateway Coliseum. Waterfall is a favorite. Waterfall is my favorite. Next time we'll figure where to go. Oh, you get a mystery gift? Oh, good. Oh, that's the Electivire Magmodar. Huh? Electivire Magmodar. Uh. I can't remember how you get them, but they're extremely powerful. Mm. Oh, you can buy items! You can buy a face! Can I? Oh, it's it's a it's face paint. Yeah. <laughs> you can buy a face. You just do face off with Nicolas Cage. What happened to face off with Nicolas Cage? They swapped each other's faces. Well, that's wild. That's Nicholas Cage, and I'm not surprised. Next time! Yeah.